Okay, hello, welcome to Cloudpunk, where we're just a flying sort of thing. I don't know the controls. Okay, so accelerate, brake, steer left and steer right. We can also go up and down. Okay, so <laughs> don't know much about it. It looks a little cool, sudden Yon Tokyo sort of Control, sort of game. So you know, this is wait. Is this channel receiving me? Uh, driver of 14 FC, this is Control. We read you. Is that you, Carmine? No, my name is Rania. No, oh, you're the new kid. I'm the new driver, yeah. Who is Carmine? He was driver 14 FB. Taxes! What happened to him? <laughs> he he Ooh, retired last house. month. Good for him. Not really. He was in the big Sector 6 crash last week. Lots of people got retired. Don't worry, you won't be flying through that section for hours yet. For hours. Where do I go now? <laughs> well, how are you handling your hava? Okay, I guess. I read your references. You're a good driver, but navigating a hava around Nivalis isn't like driving your flat country roads back home. <laughs> Wasn't paying attention. Was looking at chat. hundred miles and up a thousand. Remember, you're not driving an old internal combustion engine. You'll need to engage your vertical repulsors or find one of the car lifts. Fly to headquarters. I'll give you more instructions when you arrive. Ooh. Thanks, Control. Well, I found the lift. Uh, one more thing for Tapsy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Um, I wonder if he'll ever tell us. One more thing. Oh, good. Welcome to <laughs> That could have been hilarious. One more thing. Um, yeah, no, we'll never, we'll never know. Welcome to Cloudpunk. Okay. Um, right. So I found a mechanic. Okay. Um, pick up payloads at Cloudpunk HQ. Oops. I'm terrible. Okay. I do want to park the vehicle because I've been um, crashing it a bit. Okay. Could you, could you fix me up? Oh. We actually come out. Hi, hello. Um, <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to say no to pain for a stupid cosmetic antenna. Okay, um, let's open our inventory. Okay, um, third person perspective. Okay, um, we've got a flute and we've got a dried blue flower and um, we've also got the antenna. But how do I put it on the antenna? Okay. Um, oh, is it on? I don't know. Okay, so payloads at HQ, 240 miles away. Okay, so... <laughs> I want to go back down, I guess. Yes. Okay, back down the lift we go. Okay, but it looks an interesting sort of, you know, we've seen it in a lot of movies. This sort of flying car taxi sort of thing so you know when i saw the game i thought hey this looks pretty cool don't know a lot about it deliberately avoided spoilers but yeah we're gonna check it out and see what's going on <laughs> immediately you know i messed up with the controls aren't as um forgiven as you like the like the up and down is pretty awkward um there's only like um you know a few controls there's no boost i've just literally pressed every bottom under the sun to see if we can make our car go faster. Maybe the payload will give us something new. Obviously there's things that we can buy and money. So I'm guessing we can um, buy upgrades for the car and things. Yeah, okay. So there's a lot of stuff in the cluster. You know, we're in money. Well, I wouldn't necessarily call us a taxi. I'd say maybe we're like um, a delivery sort of company. Okay, we'll find an location and get money. So that's pretty cool. You know, we don't even need to actually do things to get paid. We just um, explore. Okay, I'm going to fly off the map. You know, obviously, it's maybe not as intended to go here because there are roads. We don't have roads as the cops are start coming. Um, let's hope they weren't chasing us for driving off the non-roads. Because <laughs> potential. I'm, I'm still going to maybe skip the roads a bit. But, you know, we can, we can follow the, the road a bit. A lot of the other cars do seem faster than us, but okay. That's as high as we can go. I can't go over the buildings. But I'm gonna skip across here. 
Okay, there's HQ. Right, so we noticed that, you know, these barriers don't really matter that much. Ooh, if we, um, if we let go of the accelerator, we can do, um, drift turns, though. <laughs> that, that is a glass wall, though. Okay, no, that's not, that's just a mechanic again. That's not the HQ, this is the HQ. Okay, I can go through here, though. Find a place to park. Easier said than done. Okay, so I can see the parking zone. Could you, could you go down? Could you, could you, could you could it go down low car? Like the down... Downward gravity isn't working so well. <laughs> so, so what am I doing wrong? Because my downward gravity isn't working. Like, Just um, vertically away, right? So. Up. That just looks okay. Go down lower, please. <laughs> we need to go down. But he's not going down. Okay, now we're going down. Okay, I don't know what I'd done before, but for some reason I'd stopped it working. Oh, I guess. One of the buttons I pressed to disable it. Like I must have locked it. Also, you know, we're we're a two-bit sort of a character. Okay, I don't know if there are any different controls when we're like in this mode. Can I steal one of these? <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Um also like you were third person. Okay, zoom in to first person view. Okay, let's do it. Hi. People. There's someone over here with something going on. Gang member, hello. Right, I'm gonna come talk to your face though. Hey, come here a minute. Why? We want to talk to you. So talk. What do you do? Deliver packages. <laughs> Delivery driver? You're cloud punk, right? So you must be thinking you're pretty badass. If you say so. Are they going to be guns and things Why on this? Nice to her? She delivers to the spire. She don't respect us. Gang member two. <laughs> Show me something to respect then. You're sassy. Acting like you weren't afraid of us. And you got I a very ain't. flat head. <laughs> she don't know who she's talking to, Razor. She don't know how you got that name. Because flat face. Razor, are you a shaving <laughs> robot? You don't got to take that from her type, Razor. You got to do something. Nah, I like her. She's got a big mouth like me. So you're both part of Block 4-0, right? You Pixel looks us. nothing like his face. I heard I there's an android two. gang I should avoid. <laughs> That's good advice. You don't want to get in our way. Why do you get such a bad reputation? We do a lot of things we ain't supposed to. Robbing people? Nah, much worse. Saving Urban them. renewal, <laughs> bitch. Oh, yeah. Wait, what? Urban renewal? Yeah, community project. Planting gardens on corporate waste ground. Impressive. Turning old factories into playgrounds. <laughs> Real hardcore shit. I mean, no, I don't get it at all. There ain't nothing in the Volus that will get you in more trouble than fucking with corporate property. Well, that guy's got a very we flat head as well. We straight murdering fools. Well, good luck, I guess. That sounds like a worthwhile thing exactly, for a gang to is. do. Hmm? Urban Just regeneration gangs, gangs, gangs. I approve. Were a bit more... <laughs> you assumed wrong, but that's all right. We ain't surprised they talk shit about us. Well, I won't. I hope you two never get caught. Fuck yeah! You was right, Razor. She's all right. You stay loose, Cloud Punk. We we'll see, see you later. <laughs> okay, block four out. Also, there's something over here. Ooh. Um, plasteel parts. Okay. Um, ruins that can maybe reuse. Okay. So obviously, there's these things and items that we've seen on the map that obviously we can collect in some different areas. Let's go get our package. Payloads, there's also other things. FC. This is going to the marrow. Tomorrow. Where's that? Tomorrow. Pretty low in the city superstructure. I'll give you a waypoint on your navcom to help you find it. Be careful down there. It's busy and it's a maze. Not exactly the rich part of town. The kind of place where you wipe your feet on the way out. Okay. Carmenus was a great driver. He got big boots to fill. He flew delivery for over 10 years, you know? How about the driver before him? 
14 FA? <laughs> Lasted one night. Yeah. Most drivers only last one night. They quit the nope. job? <laughs> they crash. One way or another, yeah. You seem like a nice kid, 14 FC. I hope you make it. Don't get lost down there in the marrow. I'll try. What's in the package? Two rules, kid. Don't miss a delivery, and don't ask what's in the package. Everything else is just guidelines. Um, do we have a time limit to do this delivery? Because I'm now looking about Welcome this stuff. to my humble restaurant in the Rye. What can I get you? Um, you don't look like the guy in the picture. You, I mean, you, you sound like you're from um, or rant the mud would lie. Um, steamed crab legs, garlic and spring onion. Not bad. Please, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> don't let all the rain get you down. See you again soon. Oh dear, we've got hunger bars and things. I hate that in games. I do. Okay, there's a card. I thought it was a person that we were um, needing to talk to, so I just didn't investigate it because he was stood on the card. But we're going to go explore, you know, even though we're meant to be doing this delivery. Okay, there's people here. There's someone, there's a person. Hi, I, I see your face. Hi, hello. Take her. Excuse me, miss. Have you seen her? Seen who? Nari. Nope. I'm sorry, I don't know who that is. Are you okay? I can see a lady on the map though, so I'm gonna I'm go okay. find her. I can't find her. I mean, do you have somewhere to stay? <laughs> I know a shelter nearby. I've been doing less driving. Why would I need a shelter? Well, your clothes raining. are rags, and it looks like your exterior dermis is breaking down. I can see some of your endoskeleton. Are we all robots? No, I can't go to a shelter. Nari wouldn't think to look Awkward. for me there. Who is Nari? She is gone, and when she left, she took all my happiness with her. Can't you call her? She does not answer. Maybe she doesn't <laughs> want to talk to you. That can't be true. Sounds like she's giving you a pretty clear message. What was the last thing she said? Oh yeah, let's meet up. That she would love me forever. <laughs> and that no black. Oh, forever. Um, sorry. <laughs> there have been a lot of accidents in the city. I'm not saying she was in one, but just, you know, it can be hard to keep in touch oh, with people. Oh, she found another guy. I have to say, this steps. city is... Too fast. It moves too fast. Okay, take her. Yeah. Take care. Do you have any leads? She had no money. She wouldn't last long here, then. Maybe the Marrow? I will try there next. Well, I'm going to the Marrow. Well, good luck. What's your name again? I'll tell her. Taiko, if you see Nari... Tell her Taiko is looking There's for some her. big bouncers. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at those absolute chunguses. Um, this, this scanning thing. I'm sure that's not something concerning. And cops. Is that, is that a reporter as well with them or are they just harassing them? Can we look? Um, oh. I mean, you're not stopping me necessarily. Hmm. Why, why won't you let me through the scanning area? So, do I do I need a different path? Can I go in the shop? No. Okay. Heartache, depression, or apathy? Okay. <laughs> I feel like there's got to be a path around without driving. Um, to shame my car doesn't update here and I have to go back to the other the other car park <laughs> on the other floor we're we gonna do it okay lower midtown we're still in lower midtown apparently I expected this to be off a of midtown you know crossing that this is a lot less busy okay so we need to go to Marvel which is a mile and a bit of a palaver <laughs> okay at least we auto run, that's pretty cool. You know, you don't have to mess about with any of that. I don't know if that's petrol or if that's our hunger gauge. It's probably petrol. So, we'll keep an eye on that. So, let's go. Obviously there was a way down there, which we went down. Although, it just took us over here. Interestingly. Didn't actually take us anywhere else. Okay, there's a lot of people to talk to. Nowhere to park, unfortunately. <laughs> so, I guess we need to find some items to go do that. 
There's a lot of parking spots over there, but I'm not going to bother with it. Big building, but I'm going to presume it looks like there's a path through. Good, okay. Parking spot here. There's some stuff. Don't know if there's anything particularly interesting. Right, let's go drop off our delivery first. Oh no, we've got to go to a different floor. I could go repair as well, because I have dinged up the car a lot, because I'm not used to the controls. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty fun and interesting, even though, you know, it controls a bit like the worst turning ever, but you know, I guess that's just me. But, you know, we can sort of drift, so if I can get a hold of the drifting, then, you know, it's not the end of the world. Yes, control, come in. Hey, uh, 14 FC, are you there? I just remembered I didn't talk to you about the ascenders. What? I think I know how they work, oh, control. Oh, you mean... You do? <laughs> up and down. They go up and also down, yeah. right? <laughs> yeah, that's about it. You know why? Ooh, we can no. fly as high as we want now. It's about vert ceilings. Not those again. <laughs> okay, maybe not. Say again, 14 oh, We've hit the ceiling. Sorry, just making a kind of joke. Go ahead, Control. Hoppers are tuned to a vertical field frequency based on the layer of the city they're in. Law. That field locks you to a maximum and minimum yes. altitude. I, I figured that's that why you need the ascenders. <laughs> they take you up or down the layer, and as they carry you, they reset your hoppers oh. field frequency. They reset the vertical ceiling and floor. Yeah, we figured that out. Um, wait, I think it was behind me. And I messed up. We've now got two loading bars, because um, I froze the game, apparently. <laughs> that, that, that's the worrying, but you've broken the game, loading bar. You, oh, you can see it. You can see that mouse. I oh, know, it's fine. But Havas fly just fine outside Novalis without vert fields. Well, that's true. Your Hava will fly fine in areas without the fields. Even in old ruined parts of the city that are off the grid. But the grid holds everything together in the city. Tracks you, gives you access to the nets, the comm, the mapping systems, the reserve power if your engine stalls. And it stops us just flying straight up to the spire too, right? That's right, kid. The CEOs don't want you flying up and looking in their windows. They prefer their privacy. I guess we don't get many jobs up there anyway. You might be surprised, kid. And um, that's weird that it just flings me off like that, completely off the car park. Tricks me. Did you try the Okonomiyaki? No. Isn't that a pancake? Right! With fish flakes! Oh, it's to die for! I wouldn't trust the fish flakes here in Novalis. Would you like to appear on my food review channel? It's on all the nets. We're looking for people to react to different stimuli. Can you pretend to be sick on cam? What? <laughs> no. There's a free meal in it for you. <coughs> or would you pretend to be really annoyed? Our viewers love that. I am annoyed. That's perfect. Thanks. Way, way to take the piss out of all YouTubers. <laughs> Hello, merchants. Merchants. Why, why are you a wandering merchants? Hi. What are you looking for? Whatever it is, I got it. Candy bars, water energy drink. Do I really want to sell you my stuff? Maybe I can sell this to a vendor for sold limbs. I mean, sure. And it seems like we might be able to use that. It's a punch card covered in holes. They seem random, but the pattern is the card itself so it could survive a bomb blast. And the I'm going to keep my cosmetic Thanks. aerial. Hey, come back anytime. Okay, so we've got some very English accents. Um, some coolant. Ooh. Maybe we need to fix that to our car. I don't know. You know, I'm, I like walking around in first-person mode. It's definitely the preferred option for, for looking at everything here. Okay, so small punch cards, maybe. It's interesting. I wonder what we're going to do with these. You look like Abraham Lincoln. This will change everything. <laughs> A bit. Where do I sign? Right here, Mr. Carva. Please, call me Irwin. 
It's from my parents. They died, you know. Cora only knows what caused the crash. I'm sure they saved their whole life to give this to me. Sure. I, I thought it would be in cash. Limbs. But my neighbor said they'd probably leave me pressed gold. That way, you don't pay so much city tax on the transfers. Can I take that now? Sure. Enjoy your you go. <laughs> Who is Cora? It's just an expression. Y yeah. You want to see what's inside? I can maybe give you a tip if it's limbs. Not every day you see someone become rich in front of your eyes, right? Just think. I can finally get the eye surgery I need. Two <laughs> what if it's two eyes? No expense spared. <laughs> I can hardly read the holocrons these days. It's all just a blur. Let's see. Just rip here and... Oh. Disappointment. <laughs> what is it? Gold? Nope. It's... Old toys. My ship models. It could be worth a lot. The R7 ICBM and Sputnik. The yeah, they, they, they might be the worth a lot. The Interplanetary 101. Why did they send these? It must be some kind of code. There's a note, right? Yeah, let's see. Dear Irwin, we know these toys were important to you at one time. We need to sell the apartment, but your father has a scheme. It seems risky, but if all goes well, this will arrive just before we land at the colonies. We're going to the stars, just like we always well. dreamed. I know it's hard out there, but if we keep our heads down, we can start sending you money for the operation. Is that they died? More than enough money. Just hold on, honey. Everything's going to be okay. Sorry. Yes. I should go. I need yeah. to go now, awkward. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> Sorry. I'm, I'm just, um... Yeah, bye. What is this? Money? Money? Is it in the bin? Okay. Good job, kid. I looked into your profile. It says you came from the Eastern Peninsula. I heard it's nice there. What made you want to come slumming with us in Novalis? It's the biggest city in the world. I wanted to make an impression. It's not easy to break out in Novalis, kid. Mm. Making it here is like trying to paint on the surface of Lots a river. Of the current of people and ideas and the crowds, they wash everything away. I'll make it. Sure you will, kid. Just try making it through tonight first. We need you to head up to the mercantile district. You're moving up in the world. What's the job? Same as always. Take a package from A to B without too many questions. A is a warehouse. B is a penthouse. Transmitting nav points now. And remember, don't let them look down on you, kid. The merchants are as far from the clouds as they are from the gutter. Okay, Control. On my way. What could go wrong? <laughs> Hello, Engineer. Hey, you. I need to ask you a question. Go ahead. I'm busy. I just need a minute. I'm a structural engineer, and I'm trying to make sure we don't have another disaster like in Sector 18. Sounds good. You're not too busy to help prevent no? that, are you? I don't know how I can help you. I just make deliveries. You're driving all the time? You see a lot of the city? This is actually my first night on the job. Ah. Still, you've probably seen a lot already. Not really. Sure. It seems like the city is falling apart. Can't you guys do anything? And we're trying. The whole infrastructure is plasteel built on top of concrete. That doesn't sound good. Held together <laughs> with ancient rivets and materials we don't even have names for anymore. The computer systems are so ancient they've gone senile. No one knows how everything is still working or how to know when it stops working. The city is held together with, well, that with tape 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 and hopes and dreams. How did things get so bad? It's always I'm been flexible. like this. <laughs> These disasters have been a, a long time coming. Can't you fix it? Fix what? The accidents. The city. <laughs> Cover everything you in have no <laughs> idea. The engineers are powerless now. With my colleagues, it's all superstition and ritual. They talk with AIs that stopped talking back a thousand years ago. They press buttons and switches that could make everything better or worse. Or they might do nothing Maybe. at all. 
They're like monkeys trying to operate a satellite array with a broken computer terminal. Okay. I'm the last real engineer. The only scientist among them all. Think you said so you're an engineer, not a scientist. <laughs> well, if you see any street signs blink three times and then turn red, come tell me, okay? Sure. What does that mean, though? Uh, probably nothing. But if you see them flash blue, well, that means trouble. So get out of there. Blue? You said red the first time. Oh, yeah. Uh, blue or <laughs> red. Interesting. Either one. What about other colors? No. Blue or red is bad. Anything else means there's no problem. So if they flash three times, uh, okay. it's green. A different or color. orange. <laughs> and if they turn purple, well, that doesn't really matter. Okay. Why not? Because blue purple. And if they turn purple, well, it's too late for you to do anything anyway. Well, that's interesting. Well, so, like, is there something on a different floor here? You're saying there's some sort of foods, but there isn't. Right, okay, I'm guessing it's up this lift. You know, has so, you know, there is this up down thing. So maybe all of this stuff that was ah, yeah, it's on a different floor. Okay, Zeta Boardwalk. Holocash. Um, okay. Wow. <laughs> Are we gonna have to remember a code? Cause that's gonna be awkward. Okay, then we've got a food vendor here. We're getting a mile away from our taxi. <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm still gonna go explore. Okay, there's some arcade machines. There's something over here. Memory chip. So I feel like we could use them to um, format it, okay. I thought it might have a code on it for, for the bank. <laughs> you know, I'm sure that we could um, maybe use those punch cards to, to take someone else's wages. You know, just like, I've clocked out, I've done my hours, and um, steal their money perhaps. <laughs> that, that feels like what they would be used for. Just a bank terminal. Another punch card all the way over here. I'm still gonna go get it. Nice little burnt out car. So yeah, even though it's like blocky aesthetics, you know, they're deliberately voxels, I guess is the correct term. You know. Block people. It's not you know, just just bad graphics. It's they've designed it to be like this. Dirk here. Also, there's a big flame. There's no jumping, I think. So, you know, we can't jump. Okay. Got $2,200. We started with like 2000 We spent some fair bit. So, you know, I feel like we're okay for money. Obviously, we've just been exploring mostly, is what's given us the money rather than anything else. Um, can I just jump off the, uh, off the thing? So, there's, there's two turns. But we can only do hollow cash. I thought the other one might be like a quest giving thing there for a moment. What could go wrong? <laughs> what could go wrong? Oh, we can't even walk onto it. Okay. I thought for a moment, can we jump off? No, we can't. Okay, I did consider it though. <laughs> you know, it's like, will it kill us? We're not even allowed. Okay. Little cleany boss. Let's go make this delivery, then we will think about what we want to do. Okay, there's a few vendors, but you know, we don't need food or anything. Got no parking fines. Okay, this this one's clearly mine. I can tell by the look of it. For some reason, it's a bit more boxy. Okay. Right. Load Hova AI. Load assistant. Load computer. <laughs> Helper. Xbox, you turn on. The generic yes. Automata. Yes, that's the one. <laughs> automata now available Connects. in generic limited mode. How can I help you today, sir? Not sir. My name is Rania. How can I help you today, Mr. Rania? I'm not a mister. Update my profile, please. 
Profile changes are locked in the trial generic automata. Would you like to upgrade to my limited no. offer <laughs> monthly subscription? No thanks. I'm good. You know, we'll stick with the free version. <laughs> we had a beep then. Premium mode. Now, just how much to replace you with an existing AI? Do you have a hard copy of the AI on storage no. media? I do. Ooh, we do. Then the transfer cost to unlock 5, the automata dollars. is fifteen hundred limbs, sir. How would you like to pay? With my ass. Direct transfer. Please insert storage media. Transfer in process. Automata personality canvas will be activated in approximately 20 minutes. Would you like to deactivate the generic automata personality yes. now? <laughs> yes. Deactivating. Please enjoy your new it automata. It did take my money. Good day, Mr. Rania. I was wondering, maybe I should have spent that money. I wonder if we spent it, you know, woods. <laughs> would it have prevented that so you know would it have broke the game because we could have spent that money I could have spent that money easily <laughs> now I wonder if it would have been like no nope, you know you don't have enough money you're stuck with me or would it have still you know just took us to you know the amount so would it have given us negative money which would give us infinite money because games work like that <laughs> you from the east, lady? You're good, but no corpse sack. Got it? Oh. Um, Golden Brown Hive, steady come down, if there is real stimulants. Okay. Stimulants give you that extra boost. I mean, these just sound better, right? <laughs> Thanks. You folks from the east are good with me, but no sack. Yeah, no sacks. <laughs> Was that an awkward, awkward joke? Um, small plasteel. Hi. You the delivery? Yes, I'm from Cl Cloud Punk. All right, here's a package. Don't open it. Don't ask me about it, and don't be late. And before you ask, yes, it's supposed to smell like. Okay, thanks. Is this real meat? What did I just say? Smells good to me. Okay. Unfortunately, there's a long way round to go there. Um. We don't seem to have a time limit, so I'm sure it's fine. Come in, 14FC. How are you handling the Hava so far? Hello, this is 14FC. Yes, everything is totally fine. Relax, kid. You'll get the hang of it. What's giving you the most trouble? The attitude. The traffic? <laughs> yeah, and how fast everyone drives. They all know exactly where they're going. You'll be that fast once you get your bearings. Faster, even. Just remember, the highways channel an induction loop through your hava. Right. I know, I want it to go faster. It's pretty simple. When you're on the highways, it's like the road is moving under you. You'll get a big speed boost. Use the highways to get as close to your destination as you can, and then cut off when you're close. I can only park in the bays, right? That's right. Havas aren't meant to touch the ground. The repulsors on the parking bays keep the undercarriage a few centimeters off the ground. It's not just a technical restriction. Corpsec defines the parking around the city to maximize traffic Interesting. flow. I guess that's a good thing for us. <laughs> and that too. Traffic jams seize up the wheels of commerce. If Corpsec have one priority, it's making sure business continues as usual. And you know, there's a law reason. Okay, they are actually flinching off. Interesting, they actually are. <laughs> but it's probably to stop the voxels all colliding, right? Okay, so apparently if we fly in the lanes, we fly faster. Which maybe we do, okay. <laughs> it's good to know. It, it tells us these things. And, you know, parking, it, it is pretty much for law reasons, you know. It, or for the game, because it would break the game if we could just park anywhere, right? There were some things that I could pick up there. Again, I'm not really paying attention to the signs. Maybe I should, because, you know, things blinking at us and flashing. Okay, well, we've got to go up a few. And, you know, if they flash three times and then change colour, we might be under attack or something. <laughs> might be a bit dangerous. So we'd want to 
Note it and get out of there, or maybe we want to investigate. I'd probably investigate, but I'm probably going to get killed doing it <laughs> with my inquisitive nature. Okay, I'm going to go fix that ding a bit because I have dinged it completely. You know, just just a little. <laughs> Hi, do you have other things? Okay, that's a lot of stuff. Okay, we have hardly any money left. See ya. Okay. I realise you told me to stick in the lanes as much as possible because it does slow us down if we go out of it. That's fine. I'm okay with that. Okay. Parking spots to go explore. You know, I'm just going to pretty much explore where we get sent to, but I'm sure we'll get sent to everything eventually. Okay, this is way up here. <laughs> this isn't our spot. It is that spot, okay. You can hear the. <laughs> That's the ascending and descending. <laughs> I shouldn't have slammed into the wall. Okay, there's a lot of um, dystopian stuff. You know, saying depression and all of that. It's really focused on that. You stood on the stuff again. <laughs> you stood on the stuff that I want. Okay, there's some basic robots. And we've got some money. Again, we need a coat. Let's do that. Okay, there's a merchant. Hello, merchant. Here's what I can offer. What a bubblegum. Street style hoodie? Or a grandma? I mean, you know. <laughs> Thanks. I look forward to seeing you. Okay. Thanks. I like this one. Put the hoodie on. Okay. That cosmetic doesn't seem to be being used. I'm going to eat the bubble gum. It'll make you go faster, apparently. Broken ordnance. Oh. Okay. I think we are running a bit faster, but not much. Picking up that before because it might expire the bubble gum. <laughs> I have your delivery. Give it here. It says I'm to deliver to Mr. De Beer. That's my employer. Given Give the it to me beef this instant. To the beer. Hey, street rat. Has this been tampered no. with? What? No. Good. Most drivers ask what's in the package. Hmm. The smell makes them curious. What's in the package? Dinner. Meat. From which animal? What a strange question. Good day. Robots eat animal. Um, hmm. considering everything is robots, <laughs> you know, and um, even the human-looking people are robots in disguise. I'm concerned. The Taurus. Okay, merchant, that's not the way to get people to buy your stuff, though, is it? <laughs> you know, maybe it's human. From Breaking barriers. 14FC, are you back in Midtown yet? Nope. Look, kid, we messed up. We need you to get through a CorpSec security checkpoint. Now, you've never been scanned by CorpSec. That's right. You wouldn't let... paid to wipe your record, so we need them to hold a clean file on you. They won't recognize me? <laughs> Not unless you've broken any other laws. Sending you a nav point. Okay, now. so I guess that's why you broke uh, One laugh. more thing, kid. <laughs> you need to go through on foot. So don't look suspicious. Or act suspicious. And don't mention Cloudpunk. Or me. Don't wear a suspicious hoodie. <laughs> sure. Okay, um, I wonder if it's at that 260 odd point meter over there. I just came looking here because we're basically here, you know, so I'm going to steal anything that's available to Nick. <laughs> Don't act suspicious, yeah, I'm just picking up all of the trash. That's apparently worth stuff. You know. Okay, I feel like this might be where we need to go, though. It is not. Train. I wonder if I can get on the train. 
Corpsec Flyer. Okay, well, I guess we've got a long way to go back. <laughs> but I feel like the checkpoint is the thing that I was trying to get through before. And I'm guessing we can have, like, reputation on crimes. And, um, you know, if we go through one of these, if we've committed crimes, it's going to cause problems. Maybe changing the clothes makes us, you know, different. But I... Apparently this makes me look suspicious, so what could go wrong? <laughs> Wearing this hoodie and going through that. What could go wrong? That's not the same one, right? No. Though it is something interesting. It's the train. Okay. So, trains go through that. Interesting. But it's not what we're going through. This is back where we were before. Where's my land? This is gap. We do need some petrol. <laughs> Ow. Give me fuel. <laughs> you know. Because we, if we run out of fuel, we're going to be in trouble. Let's find this um, land. It's got to be here. This is where we were before, but now parked on this side. It's okay, so. Through we go! Hi. Hold up, lady. Let's see either your citizen license or your voluntary contribution. I wish you people would just call them bribes. What's that? Nothing, officer. Here's my details. Okay. I just have to create a new record for you and then... Hold, please. I'm getting a message in my earpiece. Yes, Agent Rio. No, sir. Her name is Rania. Cloudpunk? I don't think so, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, I'll no, I'm her. definitely not with Cloudpunk. Yes, sir. I'll tell you if I think she's lying. Ma'am, are you now, or have you at any time been a part of the illicit delivery service known as Cloudpunk? Cloud Never <laughs> heard of them. Hold, please. Yes, sir. She says she's never heard of them. I believe her, sir. Okay, sir, I'll let her... Yeah, no, that's her. definitely not suspicious. She can't hear me. Hmm? Hmm? Yes. Yep. Okay, then. I'll do that. <laughs> sir, yes, sir. Okay, miss, you can go. Your details have been updated. When I scanned your ID, our server yeah. said you're a musician from the Eastern Peninsula. Wanna play us some music? <laughs> Maybe another time. Do, 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 do. I will play the flute for you now. I I personally can not, but I've seen the stream as you can. <laughs> okay, so there's a lift to go up somewhere, and all this other stuff is up. What would be good is if these things didn't, you know, look like they were on this floor as well. Rory! Yo, what is up, listeners? This your boy Rory Alpha giving you a shout out from Midtown, where I am with the people. You look nothing like your picture. Like this young lady <laughs> here who is desperate to have her say on the Undernet's hottest loudcast. Could you get the microphone away from me? Oh, we have here another stuck-up young woman, too busy shopping and using makeup. I call it fake up because it is really lies to trick men. Yikes. She doesn't even have time to talk to my listeners, the Bro Brothers. Your listeners are called the Bro Brothers. That's right. The Bro Brothers are my pack. Am I right? Ooh, ooh. And your show is about? Finally giving the bros a chance to speak out, to have their say. I don't think you want me on your show. And I sure don't want to be on it either. Now let's try to talk to someone. Okay, Chaz. We got to find Alpha the real Chaz. of the people. We need a real, a real man on this show. Am I right? How about that corpse sec officer? He seems to be looking at you. He seems like a real man. All right, bros, we're going to boost now. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit up that notification bell and I, I got to go. Yeah, no. Um, all the things I do not do on YouTube and oh my God, it's <laughs> Yeah, no, but I don't. Uh, if, you, if, if you like these people, you're just like, no, no. Hi. Your face looks familiar. Do you need some stems? Pheromones. Ooh. 
Social responses in my favor sounds pretty good. Thanks. See you again. Yeah, I'll, I'll use that to my advantage. Okay, so there's another thing there. It's saying return to our car, but... I also want to go up this lift. I'm going to check out that other floor a different time. First, we're going to go up. Yeah, I'm not about this. Hey, I'm a fake person. I fake all this nonsense. And I call you Rosecourt because there, that that really is respecting you and shows you how much I really care about you. Access restricted. Oh, it requires a code author. Interesting. I'm never going to remember these locations. I I respect my viewers and listeners too much to, to do all this nonsense. I'm just going to be me. I'm not going to be a fake twat. That's also not Okay. You know, I'm, I'm just going to be perfectly normal person. I'm going to fake the bonus and all this nonsense. Medical research. Okay, we gathered some stuff. There's a shop around here. Julia, hi, that's, that's you again. We got the social, you know, situational thing. Our cop's not staring at us. <laughs> okay, time to get out of here. Where are we going next? And why did they need us to go through that checkpoint in particular? Hmm. You know, just, just go through it and then back to our car. With us. Your automata custom personality is ready for instantiation. Cake Oh no, Camus I saw now. that cake Yes, owner. please. Kanima. Sorry, Konima. Konami. Camus, are you there? It's you. I missed Over. you. How are you? Happy. What am I? doggy. Feels strange. You've been loaded into my vehicle's automata slot. Why can oh. you talk to me, doggy? Sorry, ah. Camus. <laughs> this is all I can afford right now. I was a bad dog? Oh my no, god, it, you were the best, it's not dog. I am just a hova now. Not as good. I know, I know. We'll get you a new body, I promise. What's up, dog? It will just take a What's while. What's up, dog? I have a new dog job. Dog from up. You don't play music anymore? I like music. Me too, Camus, but we need money. We lost the house. I had to move us to Novalis. Oh no. Is that a good joke? We hate the city. <laughs> we did. Maybe it's not so bad now. I'm doing deliveries. We are doing deliveries. I am helping. I am yeah, helping. We're a team, right? I will help. I feel not so good, though. I am sleepy now. It's the automata slot in the Hova car. It's pretty limited, and the hardware runs at a lower clock cycle, so you might need to take it easy for a while. Don't understand. Your higher operating functions are multi-threaded, but that's not supported with the hardware we have. Uh. That means it might take you a bit longer to figure things out, but you'll get there. I'm sleepy. Okay, rest for sleepy now, Camus. I'll bring you online soon. And Camus, I missed you too. Old friends. Okay, is there a parking spot? There is, okay. Is this just not where we were just were? <laughs> okay, we're getting a phone call. There's a face here. So I'm going to go, maybe. No, not for the We sent someone else. We need you to... Damn it. Sorry. We need you to pick up a package from Cambria Heights. It's a residential zone. I'm sending a nav point now. Okay, on my way. Wait. 14 FC. Is there a problem? No, never mind. Good luck. Hello, Molly. How's your sister? <laughs> Are you counseling? Um, no, sorry. Please do not be shy. We talked about this in the chat room. We cannot begin until you confirm your identity. Oh dear. We agreed on Kelson for you. I am Molly. I'm not Kelson. Is My it a is prostitute? <laughs> oh, I see. I'm sorry too. Damn it, I cannot take any more of these time wasters. I hate to be made to wait. Even worse when it Especially is. Especially when you're a robot. At least your clothes are kind of waterproof. They're made of... Latex. Yes. 
<laughs> and I suppose that is a small mercy. <laughs> mm, latex in the rain, that doesn't weather. sound... You're so That's weird. I'm a delivery driver, so I'm mostly in my hava. Yes, of course. You, you said like I'm not, work? I'm running around a lot. I'm still deciding. <laughs> you? It is honest work. I make people happy. Are you... 100%. <laughs> sex worker? Yes, oh, a dominatrix. A dominatrix. I no wonder you're in latex. I found something I was good at. This is it. Okay. You have something else to say. Spit nah, out, I'm then. good. I have nothing else to do, it would seem. I know you are curious. Does it feel bad hurting people? Even if they want it? No, not at all. I am helping them. You really <laughs> believe that? I know it. They thank me. With words and with huge handfuls of money. Has it ever gone wrong with a client? Probably. <laughs> no. Seriously? You've never hurt someone more than they wanted? It's all done with augments now. If I crack a whip, it's just for show. Ropes and chains are ornamentals. The augments bind them, hold them down, cause them pain. That way, no one is ever hurt worse than they want Well, in that case, are you even I doing anything if the old ones is doing all the work? <laughs> well, Molly, I hope you get another client soon. And get out of the rain. I shall. Business is good. Run along and get yourself dried off. We all wear a uniform to work. Whether we think we do or not, no need for it to be waterlogged. Yes, everyone wears a uniform for work. Even when you're wearing your normal clothes. You don't wear your best clothes to work, you just wear the same <laughs> jeans and a t shirt, or, you know, unless work really hates us and, you know, you hate your bath and then you start wearing whatever the heck you like. <laughs> Okay, that's the worst thing to hear after talking to uh, Dominatrix. Faster, stronger, harder. <laughs> Was that deliberate game? Okay, let's try not to crash whilst we're driving in the motorway for a mile. I still want to go fast on this. It's like, you know, this is how you go fast, but it's not fast enough. Okay. Shortcut. Because <laughs> it's still a mile away. I realise that there is traffic lane somewhere. There we go. Ow. <laughs> oh, it's not even a proper lane. Come on, you could speed me up through this. Because it's the it's the road. It's, well I guess we're back off the beaten track. There's something that may be a road over there, but again, probably isn't the main roads. Not gonna go there. <laughs> Hello. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna drive wherever the hell I want. Come on, give me a road. If if it's a thousand miles away, you could give me a proper road, just so it can be a bit faster. That would be nice. Shortcut. <laughs> Where we're going, we don't need roads. A lot of people here to, pow, to talk to. Ha! Neo Donter. Dotenbury. Yeah, I dinged the taxi up a fair bit. <laughs> I'm sure it'll be fine. Definitely won't cost all of our money. What happens if we go back? Because it's going to cost all of our money to, <laughs> to repair this. Okay, I need to park. We're just picking up a package, right? We're not, like, dropping anything off for the moment. I have got all this trash that I've been picking up. That is a point. You know. Some of these will be worth some things. The punch cards, I can't sell them. Elon Cosmetic Procedures. Elon cosmetic procedures. <laughs> okay, um, is this Elon Musk's future? I mean, I realize he doesn't call them Elon, but, you know. You from the East, lady? You're good, but no corpse sec. Got it? Yeah. Okay. I can't sell to you. Thanks. You folks from the East are... Well, see ya. East downtown and West End world. No. 
East End boys and the West End girls. Said we're from the East and you're from the West. Cambrian Heights. Control, I'm at the destination and no one is here. Control, Camus, are you awake? Yes, I am awake. Excited. Want to help. Can you scan the area? Local scan. Look for ID chips on possible Hello. delivery containers. This doesn't look scary. I don't know how. Wait, I know how. I think. What is box? A box is a square cube. No. What is that box? It's right there. Okay, I see it. I guess that's the package then. Why is no one here? I have bad feelings. Me too, Camus. Well, I mean, there are some people literally down there. As they're coming for us now. Hi. Bye. Okay, they didn't chase us. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go explore all of this. And, um... <laughs> yeah, no, they definitely didn't start moving when we picked up the box. What were they doing in that back alley? Like, looked like someone might have been planning to jump. But, um, maybe they're waiting to jump off. And not in a sexual way. <laughs> Albion Pacific, okay. I came over here because there's more stuff. Even though it's a punch card, you know, and it's not anything useful. No flashing lights, nothing scary. I think we're safe. Okay. Carry the box to your vehicle, and I'm sure nothing deadly will happen. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. The game is doing a good job of making it seem like something could- Oh my god, where is this gonna go? There's a house? So, are we gonna go over to this house thing and see what's going on all the way over here? I have to explore. I have to. I can't help this. <laughs> okay, maybe this isn't going to the house, but... It's away from our car. Maybe there's a parking spot over here, I don't know. There's a lot of people. Helipads? There's something on there. Tobayushi HQ. Some coolants? Okay. I mean, do we really want to be on the headquarters of something? The cops? Cops. It's the cop station. Okay. Don't think we want to be carrying around suspicious packages to the cop station. Okay, there's a guy that's selling some drugs. We don't care about him. He's asking for it. The drugs. Literally. He wanted me to sell them to him. Okay. Good for you. This does loop round back to our car at least. So <laughs> we weren't in a terrible situation. You know, we didn't have to go awkwardly right the way back around. Okay, so there is another parking spot there. You can't steal the cop car, though. But, you know, if they were following us suspiciously, we'd be laughed on. <laughs> we give them the slip goods. Where are we taking this? Ah. Why do I crash into everything? Noise. What noise, Camus? Tiki. Tick -tock, tick -tock. It's a bomb. Tick -tock. From the package. I hear it too. Where are we taking this? I still have bad feelings. One second, Camus. Control, come in. Control, this is Driver 14 FC. Come in. This We've is. We've got important. a time limit. Driver 14 FC, this is Control. Please deliver your current package with our. Yeah, where well, to? Control, why is this package ticking? You don't think you should have to do that. Control, what's it's happening? It's a bomb! Uh, nothing. I've been informed that you're to stop calling us about the package. Deliver it quickly. That is all, please. No more communication until delivery. Camus, I don't know what to do. Not I am nervous. That's what. Why? I am nervous because you are nervous. Maybe we can throw away the tick. -tock. Maybe. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. <laughs> Maybe I could dump it at the trash chute in Section 8B. That sends it into the refuse collection at the base of the city. 
Nothing ever comes back from there. Will Mr. Control be mad? Yes, but I get a bad feeling too, Camus. I think it will be bad either way. Options. I want to help, but don't know what to do. I feel like dropping oh, no, a bomb to the base of the city when we've been to told that it's um one. held up by duct tape and you know, barely barely holding together. I feel like dropping a bomb at the bottom of the city might be a terrible idea. Somehow. I feel like the whole city might might suffer if we do that. You know, <laughs> like like we'll blow up the entire infrastructure of the city. I kind of don't want to do that, <laughs> so I'm gonna drop it off to the actual destination. And um, if someone happens to to die whilst we're doing it, so be it. Here's my parking spot. Some people haven't respected the parking spots. You know, did this. <laughs> this is my decision. I guess it was nothing. That looks like a disposal. We, did our job, Camus. we shouldn't fine. ask so many questions. I am not sure. You want to say something? If it is okay? Sure. Is this a job good? It pays good. Are we doing good things? No more questions, please, Chemist. Okay. I mean, that looked like a... Trash disposal or bomb disposal. I feel like... I feel like we did good, you know? We, we, we got rid of the bomb without blowing up the city. We did okay. <laughs> Hi. Damn it. Forbidden. Phone call. I was trying to talk to the vendor. Driver 14 FC, this is Control. Is there anything you want to tell me about that last job? No, nothing. All right. Well, I'm just glad it went okay. For your next delivery, please proceed to the following nav point to collect a package at Life Corp Industries. You'll need to find a way up to the roof of the building. Our client didn't leave us an access code, but, um, well, you're a smart kid. You'll think of something. Control out. Damn it. <laughs> we could have to find out. Or well, hack access codes? I'm sure someone will tell us an access code. I'm sure the other option would have been worse, you know, with the whole city being held together by duct tape. Like, nothing's exploded. It's... We delivered the bomb to, to be taken care of by the authorities, I'm sure. That seemed like a, the right place to take it. We're probably going to have a time limit and more decisions. <laughs> but it's fine. Okay, um, I've done some severe damage to my car. I will... Pay the iron price. Ooh! A red tracer unit for the hover of the Dionysus to use the red contrail. Racers always go for it. Yes, we've done a lot of damage. Ooh. She even said it was the same. <laughs> I mean, I realise it's just a train, but you know. Um, immediately crashes. <laughs> Here's our parking spot. Okay, I feel like. The red line made, makes it go faster. Does it go faster, Stripe? <laughs> it didn't. But you know. Okay, um, what could go wrong? We're walking through this again. Okay, it's fine. It's the lift I went up before. Anyway, boss. Hi, you've, you've got a code for me, right? I'm here to collect. Sign here, please. You'll find the package on the roof through the hotel entry to your right. B965E. Is B965E. And don't talk to the package. Don't what? You'll see what I mean. It won't shut up. It's going to Avalon well. Heights. They're expecting you. Is it a companion cube? Is it Wheatley? Driver 
14 FC, this is Control. I'm just checking that you made that delivery. I'm on it. Checking up on me? No, we're just doubting. What was that? I don't know, driver. The city AI acting up again? Relocating a district, maybe? No, this felt like an explosion. Yeah, you're right. I'm getting reports over the wire right now. It, it was an explosion. Control? Was it at the Metro Hub? No, well, it was in that district, but it was in the bay. In the delivery bay? Yes. Control? Did I just... Unrelated. Completely what? unrelated, yes. Your delivery was unrelated to the explosion. But I... Authorizing a bonus payment <laughs> for driver 14 <laughs> So shots are off. Transferring additional funds now. Why am I being given more money? Control? Um, driver 14 FC, we are not authorized to discuss previous jobs. Uh, that's in the rules? Mm. I thought they were guidelines, not rules. Please complete your outstanding contract at Life Corp Industries. Control out. Control? I want Control. to, but you know, Cavus you're not going to let me click on this and some yourself. What happened? I am nervous. That was a big boom. My windows got shaky. Did we do that? Yeah. No, we didn't do anything wrong. Okay. Ooh, the sky looks really cool. That's a cool sky. It's completely fucked. <laughs> but it's a cool sky. I mean, it did memorize it, but it's nice that it was in the top right hand corner. Yeah, no. Um. That definitely wasn't a... What's it called? Ooh. We have to pay with things like the resources. Okay, so that's why we got cool looking things. But this girl is probably the girlfriend for that guy down there, right? Um, what's it called? Oh my god. Nestor Cray! That's a Nestor familiar name. Nestor Cray is wishing you a good day, stranger. Normally I don't sell to your kind. But total record these days. Wow. Might have thrown away something so expensive. Why? Sounds pretty good. Liquor. Liquid sun. Hmm. Um. Can I sell some things to you that they're not worth a lot? Broken augments. So less hair on it. But we might need these, unfortunately. So, you know, I'm, I'm going to keep hold of it. Okay. I could sell you my old clothes, interestingly. That'll be all. Nestor Cray will. I wonder if they're like backers that have, you know, been named Christy Hex. Have you seen my little one? She must be here Damn, somewhere. Sorry. Little one? My white snapper, my little oh. mouse. Have you seen her? Um, no, sorry. I'll keep an eye out, I guess. If I find a mouse, it's going to be a literal mouse, isn't it? Like a computer mouse. A white computer mouse. Because <laughs> they're all robots! Fisherman! Popular magazine in the marrow. Casting thousand limbs for a permit. Okay. And there's another... Area. <laughs> Again, we go off the bees and track from Marl and collect everything. And then we can think about things. Okay, so that's just a barrier that we're not allowed through yet. Again, you know, it's probably one that we can go through later. The food mood. But there's no one in there. Okay, there's an item over here. We're gonna go loot that. Then there's even more stuff. Okay. Then we'll go collect the package. I didn't pick up the package because it might be time limited, you know. Hi. Interesting. This is somewhere that we're going to come to later, right? This guy's going to get in. The train. Okay. It's the train. And obviously we're going to end up on the train later. Maybe going to the um, Omibu Resort. And then maybe this food shop will be open later. But then there's this area that's also marked up. Thorax. Is it some sort of club? 
<laughs> Again, I feel like I'm not meant to be going off and exploring as much as I do. You know, these things are probably you're meant to come to later when when it tells you to. I'm not seeing any, you know, reason to be easy, honestly. Just the yeah. Damn it. Lift. Lift. Finally. <laughs> World's slowest lift. Fire assortment. Also, this lift isn't going down it. Temporarily went red. Okay, I had to step off and back onto it to get it to go down. <laughs> Maybe I stepped on it too quickly. Was to go mumbled. Excuse me? Why why was the lift mumbling? Oh my package, of course. Hello. Hello, package. <laughs> Just ignored it. With some sentence AI back it. To Avalon Heights. And we're definitely not to talk to it. it. Feels like there's stuff for sale in there, but apparently not. Not for us. Also, you know, clearly we're gonna rob someone's bank with a code later. You know, we've established that. Hello. Can you hear me? I can hear you, Box. You're not How meant you to talk today? to the box, doggies. Yes. We're not supposed to talk <laughs> to the box. I completely understand. Uh, uh, are you an android too, Camus? Fine. You can answer him, Camus. I am an automaton. I am a dog. Or a car. Dog car. I'd have gone for I a car. I am a dog car. How strange. Hey, fella. You're a box. I am in a box. My name is William. What are you if you're not a box? I told you, I am William. But what are you? Will I am. I was a sous chef in Little China, but not anymore. I'm moving up in the world in a way that makes me sad too. How come? Because you've lost your corporeal form. Because fault. I won't be able to talk to little people like you anymore. That will be a shame. We're taking him up a floor. But it will all be worth it. Avalon Heights. I can't wait. What will you do up there? I don't know yet. It's exciting. Maybe. Maybe something. <laughs> yes, no. Someone also just suspiciously bangs about my door. So, um, you know, concerning noises. As a personal assistant to some pop star. Or maybe even a CEO. Sounds interesting. Perhaps I'll be an executive at one of those big corps. Hiring and firing. I would love to fire a human one day. How do I can him? No offense, driver. <laughs> I said there are actually humans. None taken. What's it like being a driver? I love to hear about poor people. Now that I will be rich, I'm in before he's not going to be remotely rich. Dinners. You won't be invited, of course, but I would talk about you. Thanks. And I've only been a driver for a little while. I was a musician. I'm not the greatest guy, perhaps. <laughs> I shall be a musician. Of course, I would be too rich and too busy to learn to play. But I might get some augments so that I can perform. That's cheesy. Maybe the saxophone. <laughs> uh-huh. Rania lost her home and we were evicted, Box. I mean, William. We had to move to the city. Oh, why? Debt corpse. Oh, yes. They can be very unpleasant. I have heard. She had to sell my body for money, too. And now you're a, a circumstance car. with <laughs> which I am familiar. I sold my body also. You see, a chef's android body is worth a lot these days. My body was the only part of me worth anything. Now I'm just a head and a dream. Can we open the box to see him? I want to see the head. No, we're not allowed to open the packages. We're not supposed to speak to them either. I am sad. You'll get over it. But it, you know, yes, if he had to sell his body, worry. that's hardly moving One up in the world. I feel like he's going to get licked like off. Mine. What will your new body be like? 
Oh, I'm sure it will be something good. I traded my old body, my apartment, and all my savings for this place in the Spire. Surely they have the best Android frames there, too. I, I feel like you're, you're going to get ripped off here, mate. I think you're going to end up with, like, you know, just, just wheels. <laughs> Where the hell are we going? Are we going in that or are we going round? I mean, you know, if you've had to sell your, your premium, really expensive body, I feel like someone wanted your body and forced you to sell it. And, um, yeah, no, you, you're just going to end up in not a great situation. What have you got for sale? Here's what I... Some shades or a jacket? Okay, well, we've already got a top, so let's, um, let's buy some stupid-ass glasses. <laughs> Thanks. I look forward to seeing you again. Even though I'm never going in the mode that we can see any of this. Sure. Oh, cool. <laughs> yeah, no. Back into first person. <laughs> At least they put the touch so you can see it. That's interesting. You know, the cosmetics do make a difference. Memory chips. Okay. Hello. I have a header in a box for you. Hello? We have a delivery? His name is William? I'm the supervisor for this shift. His name is Robert Paul. Android supervisor, Reginald Esquire Buckley Senior. You're a vacuum cleaner? <laughs> no. I am a refuse you dumb disposal in his head. officer <laughs> with cleaning functions. The senior refuse disposal officer and this is our new recruit william your head will be mounted on a digit lux cleaning unit 3000 oh. hey Thalia, how's it going on the yeah i'm having a good day how's your day going floor of avalon heights as the junior and now he's a cleaner unit. sorry william <laughs> feels bad sorry for what i am to be the junior apprentice please pass but me you were a chef Bentley. and now you're a cleaner to get to work <laughs> and you do understand that we can no longer be friends, right? I like you and your pet human, but wow. it just wouldn't be the done thing to be seen with you. Oh, I understand. I am happy for you. Goodbye, yeah, William. Yeah, you sound completely pretentious, William. Good luck with that. Hey, Tharia. Hello. How is your day going? Also, I hope you can hear me, because, you know, sometimes I speak quiet. <laughs> okay, I'm going to go explore... You're not having the greatest day, but hopefully you're better than me tomorrow. Hopefully, you know, you can always only hope, but sorry to hear it's a shit day. But tomorrow is Saturday, so, you know, it's the weekend at least. <laughs> and that's something. Do you miss no, William? he's just an idiot. In the I box do now. not. Okay. Me cool, neither. good to hear you're hearing me well, fine. Well, we took <laughs> William to his new home. I think we should go and check on ours. Are we actually going home? We now? have a home! Is it big? Does it have a garden? Never seen it. <laughs> Do I have my own room? Sorry, Camus. It's not really a home. It's just a place where we can stay for a while. And it's all I can afford on a Cloudpunk salary. No pool, no butler. I'm not even sure we have running water. Maybe we can go somewhere nicer if Cloudpunk pays us lots. Camus, life is going to be hard here in Novalis. You need to prepare I'm exploring way too far. I'm going to get completely lost. Even this place <laughs> might be too expensive. We can't afford to mess up. I'm going to go back to my car before I lose it entirely. One bad night and we could be evicted. I understand. So don't get excited about this new place. It's not much. Okay, okay, I understand. I am still excited. We've got a random dog. Um, so, we're a delivery driver. We seem to be... Working for like an illicit delivery driver company. We may have accidentally blown something up because we delivered a bomb. And um, it's in some sort of neo dystopian future. And we've installed our pet dog robot as an AI on our car, which is talking to us. And um, basically, we're just going around driving and talking to people. And. There's a lot of taking the piss out of YouTubers with a lot of the people that we meet. 
<laughs> and things like that. And um, it's very big, and it's very easy to get lost. So you know. <laughs> but yeah, it seems interesting. Obviously, it's all um, in block form. You know, everyone is blocks. Most people seem to be robots. Even the people that look like humans seem to be robots. So, you know, I, I pretty much haven't got a clue what's really going on. But, you know, it's interesting and it's fun enough to play. So, you know. But hey. <laughs> also, you hear random things like the... The voices that you hear in the background, I don't know if you can necessarily hear that. They say some weird things on over the radios at times. It is the first time playing, so you know. Also, I'm trying to find my car again. Hopefully I can find it. I may be. How have I ended up back on this bridge? Did I not go back down? Am I stupid? <laughs> I, I think I'm on the wrong floor. I think my, my taxi's below. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Okay. I may have accidentally ran in a circle there by complete accident. <laughs> Trying to find my way back to the car. But hey. Okay, we got back to the car. So now we've got to drive back to our apartment for the first ever time. Also, I'm going to crash into that wall. Going up and down is not the easiast thing, it's a bit slow, our tax is a bit slow in general. Obviously, 